Welcome to the Coffee and Lipstick Nolt YouTube channel. Here's Jenny. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Sample Sundays. I know I kind of missed it last week so I'm sorry but I do still have the samples that I pulled the week before to give you reviews on and then we will pull some new samples and some new lipsticks and try those out for the week. Now I do have an announcement that I want to make. So I decided to try something different again on my channel. I feel like I say that a lot. But so what I want to do is do monthly giveaways. They're not going to be like huge extravagant. The new palette that's out, you know, giveaways I can afford on a monthly basis. So here is how you are going to enter these giveaways. Once a week, it could be in any video, it could be at any time, I'll give you a keyword. On that video, I want you to put the keyword in the description box of the video. Just comment it down below. That's all you gotta do. Incorporate it into your comment, just put that word. However you wanna do it is fine. You have to get each of the four keywords. It doesn't mean you have to remember them, just as long as you comment them on that video. Like, say this video has a keyword, and then a video next Wednesday has a keyword. You don't have to know this one by next Wednesday. Just make sure you comment the keyword of the video in the comment section of each video, and I will check and make sure you have found all four of the keywords by the end of the giveaway. So each one will go for four weeks, and then I will announce the winner and send you your prize. So, I don't know, what do you think? Kind of cool? I thought it could be kind of fun. So, to get things rolling, I thought I'd give you your first keyword here in this video just to make sure everybody fully understands how this works. So the keyword in this video is welcome. So comment welcome down below. Over the course of the next four weeks, you'll receive three more keywords. And then I will announce the winner, and each time I give one, I'll kind of walk you guys through it again, just to make sure you understand, and hopefully this goes smoothly, and hopefully I'm explaining it better than I feel like I am. So again, the keyword, first keyword is welcome. There will be three more coming up, so make sure you're watching the videos and listening for those next three keywords so that you have a chance to win that giveaway. So let's get into the actual Sample Sunday video. Let's go over the samples I pulled two weeks ago. Oops. Okay, so the first one was this little Chloe perfume. I have an itty, 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 barely a bit left in there. Maybe just enough to spray today. Let's see. Can I? Oh, no. No, it's not enough to spray at all. But I did like this. Obviously, I used it all up. It smelled really good. I don't think I like it enough that I would like want to go out and buy it, but I liked it. It was nice. As far as the samples I pulled, remember two weeks ago I pulled three because I had this little baby sample. Um, this oil-free face cleanser by La Fresh. I did use this, now I did take my makeup off before I used it because it does say, um, I feel like it said light makeup. Hold on, where did it say that? Oh, gently cleanses, detoxifies, and removes light makeup. So. Having like a full face of makeup on, I didn't think it was going to take that off. So I did remove my makeup first, and then I used this to clean my face. And it was really refreshing. I really liked it. It was pretty nice. So, I don't know. I haven't looked into how much those are, but they would be pretty handy. The other sample that I really enjoyed was the Jersey Shore Spa Anti-Aging Lip and Hand Polish in Vanilla Bean. Um, I mostly just used it on my lips. I do also have the e.l.f. lip exfoliator, which I feel like in the summer, it's not as harsh. And in the summer, my lips aren't as chapped. But in the winter, my lips get very chapped. And I feel like this one that's a little bit harsher would be a little bit better in the winter time to exfoliate my lips. So I feel like I'll hold this aside until winter and use it more then. The third sample I pulled that I did not like was this Smashbox X-Rated Mascara Volumizer. So I'm just gonna toss this because every time I used it, I felt like my eyes were burning. And by every time, I mean twice, I only used it twice. 
I gave it two chances and I was done. I'm not going to mess around with something that's making my eyes burn. I don't know what it is because I have another Smashbox mascara that I have used in the past and it was fine. But I don't know. Something about this. My eyes burned using it. So that was it. Done. No more. And then I pulled two lipsticks. The ColourPop in... Uh-oh. Ooh. I don't know, all the writing has gone off of here, so I really don't know the name of this anymore if I once did. Maybe it says Be Merry. Maybe. And I will insert a picture of that one somewhere around here right now. And the second one I pulled was the Kate by Rimmel in the shade 12, and I will insert a picture of that one somewhere around here right now. And then, because I liked both of them so much, I thought I should try mixing these and see what happens. And I did, and I loved it, and I'll insert a picture of that here, right now. So I really enjoyed both of these lipsticks. They were awesome picks and perfect colors for summer, and mixed together, I thought they looked really cool too. So, that was a good week of samples. Good two weeks. <laughs> My bad. I won't do that again, I promise. So, let's pull... Our next samples, starting with perfume. Let's dig on in here. Oh, this feels like a tiny one. So, Catherine Malandrino, Style de Paris. Let's see what this smells like. Well, since I couldn't put on the other one because it's empty, let's just put on this one. Now here's what I can already tell is going to be a downside to this one is it's not a spray top. It's like a, a dabber. Ooh, but it smells really good. I might be able to get past the uh, non-spray top on that one because that is super fruity smelling and I'm loving it. All right, let's pull our two to three samples. Mix this guy up. Let's do, what's this? I'm holding two. There, it's one. Okay, so I'm going to pull three because this is a smaller one. This is the Naked Skin Ultra, Def Ultra Definition Powder Foundation. And I'm not huge on powder foundation, but we will try it. Um, <laughs> don't really have a shade, but I guess we're going to try the light warm and hope for the best. Next up, this guy, Smashbox 1.2. This must be the Smash 2 foundations. Okay. This is the Smashbox foundation. The fact that it's in a 1.2 kind of worries me a little. But we'll see. One more. It's this guy. And the Dr. Brandt Microdermabrasion Skin Exfoliant. So those are my three samples. And now to pull two lipsticks. Do you guys like the two lipstick idea? I'm going to keep doing it because I liked it, but did you guys like it? I hope so. Alright. Let's... Hold on. i got to clear some space. i got too much stuff. Alright. Lipstick number one is Too Faced La Creme Lipstick in Loganberry, which is a quite deep red. I love the lipsticks. And lipstick number two. Is this one right here? It's not, I lost it. And 
right here. This is LA QA and Company Cheeky Lip. So this is a very, another very corally lip color. Well, let's go though, because I have a bright and a dark lip for this week. So, excited to try this. Kind of nervous about this Smashbox foundation. This looks so dark. And it's like empty. What the heck? Do you see that? It's like, there's nothing in there. You know what, you guys? We need to pull another sample because there's nothing in there. Sorry. Rewind for a second. And let's get our actual third sample going here. Okay. Try this again. I'm trying to like not look at anything. Let's try this. Okay. Let's try this guy. What's this? Okay. This is better. There's actually something in this sample. This is the um, Miracle Worker Overnight Face Mask by Philosophy. This will be much easier to test out for you guys with actual product in it. I don't know how that Smashbox thing got in there with nothing in it, but we're going to toss that so that doesn't happen again. Okay, now we have our lip colors and our samples that we'll be trying out for the week. Don't forget your keyword, guys. And as always, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!